Um, do you want to help me pick out some outfits? Oh, you do? Thanks. I bought a few things recently. I don't know why. It's not like I can really wear them anywhere. But I don't know. I just wanted to like talk about clothes and like put some cute outfits together. So that's what I'm going to do. One of my first purchases were these Hello Kitty Converse and I'm literally obsessed with them. They're just freaking sick and I've been kind of like wondering how I should style them. Um, and this is my first outfit that I've come up with. Please don't ask why I'm not wearing socks. I promise I wear socks when I wear sneakers. I just don't want to have to take them on and off. Here's my first fit, what do y'all think? Um, I thrifted these pants a while ago, the shirts from H&M, my Converse. Actually, I have a few accessories I wanna put on. I'm probably gonna keep these same accessories on because I feel like they match a lot of my stuff, but I feel like my style has just changed like a ton and I just have bought some things. Okay, this is just unrealistic to think that I can put these in while looking at the camera. I bought this also. Okay, here's my first fit that I've been, like, I think it's cute. What do you guys think? I'm probably gonna ask that a billion times in this video, and if I do, I'm sorry. But that's what this video is all about, is you guys just being my friend and helping me tell me what outfits are cute. <laughs> Maybe you guys should, like, rate each outfit, tell me what you think. Um, I know fashion is subjective, and you're not gonna like every single one of my outfits, or maybe you will. But still, be nice, because it's fun that way. Beautiful. Outfit number one, complete. I feel like because the shoes are like what I want to draw attention to, I'm kind of keeping this more minimal. So I'm gonna change into a different top, see how I like that. Okay, here's number two. I was actually dumb when I bought this. This is the Devin and Jesse collab with Marc Jacobs. And I wanted the shirt so bad that I bought it in an extra small when it was, because it was sold out in a small, which is what I usually am. So now this is in an extra small and I, it's too small for me. What a surprise. But I think it's so freaking cute. I don't know. I just, I think it's so cute. Like the little heart handcuffs and then, oh, it's so cute. Like if you saw me walking down the street, would you be like, wow, her outfit's cool? Or would you be like, eh? Be honest. This is too bright, I think. I'm pretty sure this one is like see-through. Alright, I'm just gonna keep my hands right here. This is just like another basic shirt that I have. Not anything groundbreaking, but I mean just simple, fits nice. That was all the tops I had for that outfit. Let me know which one was your fave. Okay, next. Um, I've been super into colors recently. I feel like like certain colors are coming back into style. Hey. I feel like certain colors are coming back into style and mixing different colors is becoming popular. But I really like this wash of blue with this wash of green. And then for the shoes, I think this green and this blue go together so well. Um, and then there's like a little bit of brown on the side. I also really like brown and green. So I can't lie, I wore this outfit yesterday and I think it is so cute. Okay, let me put these on. I used to cuff my pants like all the time and now I'm just like, I'm against cuffed pants. I don't like them. I think when long pants fall over sneakers like perfectly, it looks so good. What y'all think of this? I love this one. Um, this sweater is like really, really lightweight. So I think it's still good for the weather right now. I got this from ThreadUp, but the brand is Calvin Klein. And then these uh, Converse I got as a gift. They are the Tyler, the creator, like golf. Something like that, Converse. Get laid, get out. And it looks so effortless, but the way that the colors flow together, I just love it. I really do. Uh, this sweater is from Luca and Gray. Obviously, this sweater is similar to the last one. It is a little bit heavier, so I don't know how long I can really wear this because it's getting warm. But same principles apply to the last one. I like this color with these, and I also like this color with this. I don't know, kind of fun, a little bit different. Which sweater do you like better? to some dresses. If you guys wanted to know, my only skill in life is being able to zip dresses up on myself. Is this inappropriate? That's talent. 
you can't lie to me. I like this dress. I really like the like cut of it. I think it's like a perfect length. Little ruffles are cute, but it is a little bit more fallish. It's just kind of like Thanksgiving colors. I don't know. That's what it reminds me of, but I do think it's still super cute. This is from Realization Par. It's my favorite place to see it dresses because they're just the Pinterest dresses. You know, it's like what a bunch of the Instagram models wear. With this, I have this sweater that I got secondhand, and I think these colors go so well together. So when I bought this, I because I bought it from like a, I bought it from Grailed, which is basically like another Depop. But when I bought it, it said the size was a medium, and I usually like my like sweatshirts and stuff like a large. So like, oh, it's gonna be a little bit small for me, but it is so much bigger than a medium. So be. Because of that, I'm going to kind of like tie something around here, but I think this is so cute. I can't lie, I've already worn this one too. And then I also have these like platform black shoes. This is also, this just like screams like a Pinterest outfit to me. The orange on this ties into the orange on this and I just think it's so cute. Ugh. I just, I really, really like the look of like sweaters and skirts. Obviously when I put a sweater over this, it gives the illusion of that. Okay, here's another dress. I'm gonna wear it with this. So I'm just gonna turn this to the back. Obviously this would be cute with like a dainty little gold necklace. I feel like the thing for me that really makes me feel comfortable in an outfit is like the different levels of feminine and masculine. For example, like I could wear like a really girly bottom or a really girly top and then have a really masculine like opposite of that. And it kind of has like, I don't really know where I'm going with this because I'm fine with wearing all like feminine or all masculine stuff. But just when it kind of balances out like that, I think it makes it an outfit really cool and really different. But here's another dress that I really like. This one is like longer. Um, I wore this on Easter, but I think the print is just really cute. It has like a different little neck that I don't really see super often. I think if you're wearing something white and you add like black accents, I think that's a really cool look, but that's just me. It looks like a little bit grandma-ish, but like a cool grandma. These next couple outfits are very out of my comfort zone and you will see why in just a second. I bought a skirt. I probably just got deodorant stains on this. If y'all know me, I don't own any skirts. Actually, I have a couple skirts, but they're all long. And I, I don't know. It's not that I was against them. I was against them for myself because I was like, that just would not look good on me. It would not be flattering. It's too girly for me. And then I saw this photo from my friend, my new friend, Emma. I found this outfit on Pinterest and I literally fell in love with it. I was like, wow, that is so cute. So I posted on my story because I like to post like just outfit inspiration that other people can see. But the thing about Pinterest is that they never, ever, ever give credit to people. So I was like trying to find where the picture's from, but it was like a screenshot from her Instagram story. So it was literally like impossible to find it. Anyway, she somehow found it. She saw that I posted it and she responded to it. And then we started talking and we became friends. And I was like, girl, where is this outfit from? It's so freaking cute. So I got the exact same skirt that she did. I have another one in white. This is just the black one. Did I get deodorant on it? I think I'm good. I, so I got this a couple days ago and obviously I have had nothing better to do than like figure out different ways to style it. I probably wouldn't wear it like this. This is just like a little too like, I don't know, maybe it's not, maybe it's not. <laughs> this just like reminds me of like, Oh, this just like reminds me of like fan fiction. If you know, you know. Um, so uh, I need to like add a little bit of something else. So hold on. <laughs> so kind of inspired by like the hoodie, I mean the sweater over the skirt look. I like hoodies over skirts too, but I think it's cute if it's kind of like looser and like off the shoulder a little bit. So it kind of looks a little like, ooh, you know? And then for this, I'm going to add my docks just to add like another element of edge. I think this is so cute. I really, 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 really like this. Um, it's just like a different silhouette that I never ever really wear because like I said, I don't wear skirts. <laughs> this is like the first skirt that I own that's not down to my ankles. I don't know. I know a jacket over a skirt isn't groundbreaking, but it's really different for me. So let me know what you guys think of this one. I just think it's different and it's so fun. I just really like messing with like new silhouettes, I guess, so. Like, do I look sick or what? I don't know, or I could just wear it normal. And like, this also is like, don't talk to me look, you know, but like, I'm still cute too much. 
So I think this is cute because I really like having like open, I don't know, I like kind of, I kind of like having it be more like showy up here. So I like having this kind of like off the shoulder-ish. And then this has a little bit of black on the back, matches the skirt. I don't know, I don't know how I feel about this one. It's like, it's cute. I have to kind of like mess up the button so it can like go over the shoulder because it's not supposed to. Maybe let's see what it looks like without that. I think that's cute too. I think when I just pull it back, oh, when I pull it back, it makes the cardigan not as long. So it shows more of the skirt, which I like. I don't know, it's cute. I would probably just wear it with these same shoes. I feel like these shoes make it look super put together because it's like platform. So it's like, oh, she tried on her outfit, you know? I don't know, what y'all think? I don't know, I don't know how I feel about this one. Okay, here's another one. I got this Choice of On hoodie like forever ago. And I actually like, I still think it's really cool. I got it in a medium. And with a little accent of red, I think these could go cool with my Chicago's. These are, I think my favorite sneakers that I own. I love them. I get a lot of questions from where I get like my Nikes from or my sneakers. And I get them from the Go app like 99% of the time. Or if I don't get them from Go, I maybe get them from Grailed. I don't trust shoes on Depop. There's a lot of fakes out there. With Goat, they do like an authentication, authentication. They authenticate them. So I trust it a little bit more. For me personally, I feel like if I don't wear long pants over my sneakers, it makes me look like I have no ankles. Like I love high tops so much, but I just think they look better when the tops are covered, at least like on my legs, like on my legs. I don't know, it's cool. It's like something a little bit different. If anyone comments about the creases on my sneakers. Anyway, what do we think? Cute, kind of looks like a little mysterious. I got mine in a small and it like barely fits. Like I can barely button it. If I was like any, if my waist was any bigger, I wouldn't be able to button it. So if you were just wondering about like what size this is, this is a small, but it like barely fits. I probably should have got a medium. Okay, here's the white skirt and I just have this graphic t-shirt that I got secondhand. And normally I would like to like tie it Okay, it just got too bright. Normally, I feel like I would tie it like this, but I kind of like the look. Like, I feel like when I just let it go, like, it makes me look really long. Like, it makes my torso look long. And then, like, the skirt is so short that, like, it makes... I don't know. I feel like it just makes me look taller and it's kind of just, like, a different... It's just, like, a different look. Once again, wearing these shoes because I think they're cool. But, I don't know. I just think it's, like... I don't know. I just like it. This shirt is kind of stretchy, so I could wear it like this. Like this. And there's a little knot right there. Let me know which way you guys like better. I think I like this way better. I just feel like it looks more kind of like model-esque, if that makes any sense. Or to go along with the sweater over the skirt, I have this. Uh, this sweatshirt is from a company called Basket Case. I don't believe it's for sale anymore, um, but it is pretty sick. I don't know. I just like it. I like the way that it looks. Maybe be cute with like a bucket hat. What y'all think? I think this is one of my favorites. Um, I like just like the black and white look. So this is like perfect. I like the sweater over the skirt. Another thing that makes me like it. I don't know. I think this is just like a cool graphic. So yeah. Or this could be cute with... I posted a picture on just my... No, maybe I posted it. Um, it's like a picture of me. It's like half of my face and I have this around my head. I see a lot of people repost it. And I'm like, damn, okay. Must have been pretty Pinteresty then. I don't know, this kind of gives me like a like a schoolgirl vibe. I would say Gossip Girl, but I've never seen that, so I don't know if that's accurate. Dumb. I think that's it for this video. That's all the outfits that I have been trying to put together. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know which one is your favorite. Let me know if you have any tips for me. Um, I'm not claiming to be like a fashion god or anything. I'm still working on my fashion sense every day. And so, yeah. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys think. Peace out. Hope you're staying safe and goodbye. Oops.